All right, welcome back to exchangetimes.net. So on this video, I'm going to show you how to make your version of Python the default version in Linux. So I've got a new VM for elementary OS and I've just installed Python 3.7 as per my previous video. So what you want to do is click on applications terminal or just hit the super plus T key. It will open your terminal. Now what you want to do if you type in just python dash dash version it will show you 2.7 is the default so if you just type in python you'll see 2.7 it's control d to get out of python and if i go python 3 it will show me the default python 3 version is 3.6.7 but i want 3.7 control d to get out so to clear the screen okay Now what we want to do, I'm going to try two things. First what we can do is go to applications and it's open files. This is the long way. And we go to file system. Oh it's home, control H dot bash or C. That's the file we want to edit. I just want to see if it's going to work in here. If you scroll down a little bit, we're looking for aliases. You'll see there's a lot of alias, grep, color, GCC. I put mine in the line below this alias alert. So that's where I usually put it in. Um, or add it, not put it in. That sounds weird. So you can do it this way, I suppose. Let's try alias space python equals quotation marks let's bring it up a bit so you can see properly working here so what you want is alias space python equals quotation marks and in the quotation marks forward slash usr forward slash bin forward slash python 3.7 because that's the version we want it to be default and let's just say close so that should hopefully have taken the uh, minimizer, taken the, the alias. So what we want to do then is verify it. So the other way you can do is you do nano, or I use nano, and you just go tolder forward slash dot bash. RC, ooh, bash RC, and put your password, and it will open the bash RC script. That's in your home directory, so this is what's one of the files is being loaded, so you can go up and down. So let's go down, it should show the change we made, and there we go so it did save it that way so usually i just use this method of going nano in the command line or in the shell and add out alias python blah 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 like you see on the screen and then you just go control o to save it press enter and control x to exit so the next step then is to log out and log in so i'm just going to pause the video quickly i'm just going to do a reboot I just do a reboot, it's quick enough, but uh, logging out and logging back in with your user account should work as well. terminal and if we type in Python now we will have Python 3.7.3 .3 as our default Python version control D to exit and that is how you set your wanted Python version to be default the one you want to work with most or working with most probably thanks for watching 
Have a good one. Bye-bye.